Hello, Josh George. College football in three minutes. We're going to break down the Sun Belt Conference. This is the G5 Conference. That's why I'm not doing each individual team. You can see the two divisions here, the East and the West. Look, this isn't how I have things breaking down. This is the uh, preseason coaches poll from the coaches in the Sun Belt conference. Look, I think that there's going to be some really good football, and I'll just break it down as I have the conference shaken out. So, I have Appalachian State being top of the East. I have them 10-2 and two, and then 7-1 and one in conference play. Look, when it comes to Appalachian State, they've got a good offensive line led by Thomas Schrader. He's a junior offensive line. 340-pound guy, that's going to be really, really good. I think the ability to run the ball is going to be huge for them. JMU is a team that was just America's darling last year and a team that I think is going to be able to do it again, and I have them at 10-2, and 6-2 and two in conference play. Then Marshall, I have them at 6-6. Six and six. Look, Marshall is going to have – the ability to throw the ball, get the ball in space, and if they shore up their tackling, they'll be a much better team. Coastal Carolina, look, it's a really great place. Lots of NIL down there by the beach, but they just lost their quarterback to the transfer portal, and when it comes down to it, they just don't have a lot of skill position, guys. Their best player will probably be Matthew McDonald, defensive back. But, man, they just don't have the skill positions on offense to be as good as they've been in the past. Georgia Southern, I've got them at 5-7. and seven. Look, they're going to try to throw the ball and throw the ball a lot. They're, uh, air raid, they're going to use a, a lot of air raid tactics this year. But, man, it, you, know, you can have a lot of 50-50 games if you don't have a lot of speed at receiver. Old Dominion. Old Dominion plays a rough schedule. And even with Jason Henderson, a linebacker, I mean, he'll be the leader of this defense. If he really steps up, they could be better than that 2 and 10. And of course, Georgia State, I have them 1 and 11. In the West, that's Texas State. Texas State is number one in Sun Belt, all, uh, first team all, uh, all, all conference. And I, I think I'll go 11-1. Um, Louisiana is going to be really good this year. I think I'm really high on uh, Malik Thomas and their offensive line as well. So I think they'll be really good. South Alabama's really close to Pensacola, right down there in Mobile Beach location. Should be able to get lots of NIL down there, but I have them going 8-4. and four. And then Southern Miss, I have 4-8. and eight. Arkansas State 4-8, and, and Louisiana Monroe 4-8. And, and in the conference championship, I have Appalachian State going 11-2 after beating Texas State. I'm Josh George. This was college football in three minutes.